On Richmond's south side, Hi. Lauren Oster Gussman Guinness, turn. opens her home and heart to animals in need. Nice catch, buddy. The social worker volunteers oh, big guy. with Lou's Labs, a rescue group based in Alexandria. Even if you've had a tough day at work, you come home and these dogs, their tails are wagging, they're happy to see you, they run to greet you. I mean, you couldn't ask for a better greeting from your spouse. Like, <laughs> it's just, it's wonderful. There he goes. Since 2016, Lauren has fostered 30 dogs. Most of the mutts she welcomes are long in the tooth. Watson, shake. I can foster one dog at a time, and I can help that dog find a forever home and a home that they're going to be loved in for the rest of their lives, however much of their life they have left. Hi. The Pennsylvania native says senior dogs make the perfect pet, but are often overlooked at shelters. And they're not super high energy. They're not going to run around your house like maniacs, you know, pulling toilet paper rolls down the hall like a puppy would. One particular foster pup caught Lauren's eye and did not let go. Amelia. Yeah. When the graying lady rumbled into Lauren's life in May of 2020, Amelia was about 14 years old. The lab needed a home after her human companion was diagnosed with terminal cancer. This is her barking. <laughs> the pair bonded immediately. Lauren's other two dogs, Watson and Guinness, adjusted to the new addition in the house. This is all three dogs enjoying pup cups on her party day. To increase her chances of finding a forever home, Lauren started posting daily messages using the dog's thoughts on social media. She says, hello everyone, my name is Amelia. She just had this, this spirit and this spunk and this sass that just, it seemed like I don't want to write about her, she should write for herself. While Amelia was gaining a loyal following, Lauren's friend suggested writing a children's book. I think it was Ernest Hemingway who said, in order to write about life, first you must live it. And I was living it with her. The first part of my life, it wasn't so easy. And to think of those times still makes me a bit queasy. Amelia's Journey to Find Family was published last spring. The book highlights the benefits of adopting a senior dog. And the story is about how she got to my home. They took me home and cleaned me up. I remember thinking then, I'm one lucky pup. Some of the proceeds from the book sales are being donated to shelters. Her legacy is a legacy of the awesomeness of senior animals. And so if people adopt more senior animals because of her, that is my intent. Angel Dog agreed that I had it right. This would be my home for the rest of my life. Lauren's furry friend passed away on May 20th, 2021. Ironically, on National Rescue Dog Day. People reached out, and especially kind of in the last couple days and in her passing, to say how much her post helped them through the dark times of COVID. While Amelia was only in Lauren's life for one short year, the author says her impact to help homeless animals Come on again. will always endure. Let's go. You may not be able to change the world for every dog, but for that one dog, their world is forever changed. Go on. If you would like to meet Lauren and pick up a copy of Amelia's Journey to Find Family, Lauren will be having a book signing at Redemption Books on March 5th from 1.30 to 2.30.